A child size swimming pool can be modeled by a cylinder. The pool has a diameter of six and a half feet and a height of 12 inches. So I'm gonna draw this. So we have a pool. I've said in meant numerous videos, it definitely helps to like art because it definitely helps you visualize. So we'll have a pool there. The height uh, of the pool is 12 inches. 12 inches. Let's just keep all the units uh, the same. So this would be one foot then. All right. And the diameter is six and a half feet. So the diameter is six and a half feet. The pool is filled with water to two thirds of the height. So we have water that's filled two thirds of the height. So I will again draw this out. So two thirds of the height, so something like this. So something like that. Okay. So two thirds of the height. So, and I will also demonstrate that by drawing this. So this is going to be two thirds of a foot because the full height is one foot. So that means the water level is going to be two thirds of a foot. All right. And um, determine and state the volume of the water in the pool to the nearest cubic foot. One cubic foot equals 7.48 gallons of water. Determine and state to the nearest gallon the number of gallons of water in the pool. It's interesting because my child, I filled up the water and I did a very similar question and answer with my wife. So um, anyway, so we take this, okay, uh, and we're going to uh, multiply or actually not multiply, we take the volume formula for a, for a cylinder, and that's pi r squared h, right? So we need to find the um, volume of the water in the pool. The height of the water in the pool is going to be two-thirds, right? And the radius of the water in the pool, that's going to be half of 6.5. That would be 3.25. So this will give us the volume of water in the pool. Uh, and it says to do it to the nearest cubic foot. So let's do that. We're going to enter that into the calculator. Squared times 2 divided by 3. That would be 2222 it says to the nearest cubic foot, so it's just going to be 22 cubic feet. One cubic foot equals to 7.48 gallons of water. So 22 feet, cubic feet, what are we going to do? Are we going to multiply by 7.48 or are we going to divide by 7.48? Well, I want the cubic feet here to cancel. So I want one cubic feet to be in the denominator and 7.48 gallons to be up top. Here, this is the same thing as, so 7.48 gallons per cubic feet is the same thing as saying 7.48 gallons over one cubic foot. See what I did there, right? So by rearranging it like this, you can see that the cubic feet will cancel. And what is the only unit that I wanna have left? I wanna have gallons. So I'm going to take 22 and multiply that by 7.48. I want to have 164.56 gallons. And it says to round to the nearest gallon. So that would be roughly 165 gallons of water. Even though it's a small kiddie pool, right? It's not surprising. Although for some of us it may be because we imagine a small pool to hold relatively little water, but it actually holds a lot.